Hey Connor, well it's coming on quarter after ten and another Halloween is over. And I have to say it was very surprising. This year we only got eight kids. That's right, eight. Just the lonely eight kids. We had a group of five and a group of three. And I saw a group of four teenagers walk by. They would be like high school students. Other than that, there just was not any kids on the street. I didn't hear anybody all night. It just, there was no one out and about. I don't get what uh, what it was. There was just no one in the neighborhood at all. It was dead quiet and no one doing anything. So it's just uh, very strange this year that we only had eight kids. This is probably the quietest year. You know, the the, the, the smallest amount we had before was 23. And now we've got a new smallest amount of eight. So... Anyways, our uh, kids aside, I hope that you had a lot of fun out trick-or-treating and that you did really, really well. And as I said before, I can't wait to see a, you know, a photo or two of, your, of you in your costume. So I look forward to seeing you and I hope you had an awesome day. I love you. I'm thinking of you. As you hop into bed, make sure you do a good job in your teeth because I know you've eaten a bunch of candy, right? Make sure you do a good job. And as you hop into bed, close your eyes, give yourself a great big hug. You know it's coming from me. And you know you can get dad hugs from me anytime, anywhere. You just have to stop what you're doing, close your eyes, give yourself a big hug, okay? And I'm always there with a hand on your shoulder, and you can draw all the strength and comfort and support from me you always have, okay? I love you. I miss you. I, had a, I hope you had an awesome Halloween, and that it is going to be a great weekend for you, okay? Love you, Dad.